Toyota CHR. This is Toyota showing it's not asleep at the wheel by actually putting some effort into designing a car for once. In actual fact, it's a small crossover hatch based on the new Prius's platform and available with either hybrid power or an underpowered 1.2-liter turbo which is, nevertheless, the engine to go for. But in the main, this is a car all about the design, from its willfully OTT bodywork to the cabin, which is Toyota's best effort since the Supra. And because the Coupe I rider's chassis was set up by a racing fan, it's actually sweeter to drive than most of Toyota's other cars, despite being a tall, not especially lightweight faux SUV. Bad, predictable news out of the way first, the hybrid is no cop whatsoever to drive. The 1.8-liter engine and D-motor only develop 120 bhp, and with over 1,400 kilograms of Toyota to shift and a CVD getting in the way, progress is neither swift nor refined. Though it can be economical if you're careful. The 1.2-liter four-cylinder turbo with its slick six-speed manual is undoubtedly the best showcase for the CHR's rather deft handling, though it's about 50 bhp short of making the best of its talent reserves. The ride's smoother than a Mazda CX-3s or Audi Q2s, so you can get away with the 18-inch rims of the spacier trim levels. You can't get a diesel CHR because Toyota doesn't like them.